Well, the high for today was 20, and that was at 4.30 this morning. And now the temperature's been dropping. It's 16 degrees. It's supposed to get down to 2 today. Set this aside for a minute. Good morning, Modern Steaders. It snowed out yesterday and last night. We got around 10 inches of snow. Ready? It is beautiful. While I was plowing last night, the battery of my truck kept draining down lower than it normally does. So I'm thinking we might need to replace the truck battery. I need to check it first and see if we need to get a new battery today. Good recharge, 575 volts. We'll keep an eye on it. All right, now that we got that all checked out, we can go inside, get the chicken feed, and go feed some animals. Talking about animals, look at this animal. He wants to come out. Oh, cats, look at him. Man. Crazy, crazy, crazy animals, I tell you. What are you doing? Oh, you're breaking everything, mister. What are you thinking? Huh? Huh? What are you thinking? Do you have anything to say for yourself? I didn't think so. Slow down. This way. The outdoor kitchen looks nice, all covered in snow. What are you doing, Pluto? Stay over here, Pluto. Good morning, girls and roosters. They're just loving their grain this morning. Right, Andy? Whoa. Pluto loves the snow, don't you, Pluto? You love running in it, huh? And digging in it.
Bet you the chickens are gonna like some nice warm water this morning. And so will the pigs. Let's go see how Culper and Pesciuto are doing all this snow. You wanna go check them out, Pluto? At some point last night or during the day, one of them logged off their water container. I had to go find it when I blocked them up last night. Good morning. What do you think of all the snow? At their nice warm hut. You don't seem to mind the snow. When we get home from work later, I'll let you out. Then you can run around and frolic in the snow. I bet that feels good. Trick it down pretty fast. Top it off for you. Free refills. There you go. Ah, oh, look at New York City. We haven't done anything new in the kitchen since the outdoor kitchen tour. If you'd like to see what we've done with the outdoor kitchen, I'll put a link right here to our outdoor kitchen tour. You're crazy. Crazy dog. I'm getting cold. Let's go back in the basement and I'll give you an update on our root cellar. I wanted to say a big thank you to all the modern steaders. We just hit 15,000 subscribers the other day. And when we reach 20,000, we're gonna be doing a giveaway. We're gonna be giving away two of our Lumna Acre t-shirts with this logo, and we're gonna be giving away an automatic chicken plucker. I'm gonna put a link right here and in the description down below that you can click on and find out how you can enter in for your chance to win. I know our basement's a mess. We got stuff everywhere, but that's because we're in the process of building our very own cave. Yeah. We are building a measures six feet across on the inside and nine feet long. It's an insulated root cellar slash cave. We have a vent here to the outside we're gonna be working on. We got our concrete and we have it insulated with fiberglass insulation and then an inch of foam board. So we have a value of R25 for insulation.
Next upcoming videos, we're gonna be working more on the root cellar. We need to finish trimming it out, and we need to build the door. I'm trying to think of the best insulating door and door that'll seal the best for the root cellar. We have a bunch of different ideas so we can keep it cool all summer and winter long. We want to make sure that inside stays nice and cool. I'm going to put a link right here to the playlist of us building our root cellar. I'm going to go to work right now. When I come back, we'll let the pigs out and we'll see how they like the deep snow and the pasture. I'm back. Let's go let the pigs out and see what they do. We'll bring them some nice warm water too. We actually got another two inches anyway. It's the snow today. The good thing about letting them out in the snow is they pack it all down too. Huh. What? Oh, I got a treat for you too. Let me give you some warm water. They don't drink that much during the winter. They'd rather eat the snow. What? Let's get the girls a bucket of leftovers. I almost forgot. For everybody that was asking, we started a Patreon page. I'll put a link to it here and in the description down below. And we're posting a bunch more content over there also, so if you wanna go check it out, here's the link. You ready? I hope you enjoyed today's video. Thanks for liking, commenting, and subscribing. And we'll see you right back here tomorrow at Lumna Acres, a guide to modern homesteading, self-sufficiency, and freedom. Bye.